The Bay Area's rock station. 1077 The Bone. Ronnie Montrose on guitar and Sammy Hagar on vocals. That is Rock Candy from 1077 The Bone. Joe Satriani, um, Sammy's new bandmate, picked that song here on 1077 The Bone, the Bay Area's rock station. That new band is called Chicken Foot. They're at the Fillmore on May 17th. That's the third date of their tour before they go over to Europe. Tickets go on sale this Sunday at 10 a.m. at LiveNation.com. We're going to play some more Chicken Foot music in a sec and give away some tickets. Do you happen to remember the very first time you ever walked into the Fillmore? Oh, wow. I don't think so. No, I mean, it's like, it's one of those things I've been there so often. When was the first time? Wow. I can't remember. Do you remember the first time you played at the Fillmore? Yes, yeah. That would have been in 88. Uh, I think we did two shows, two sold out shows. That was pretty crazy. It was right after Surfing with the Aliens? It was. And, uh, you know, we were still trying to figure out how to be an instrumental rock trio. And uh, so there was, I mean, just a ton of playing. The shows had a lot of improvising. And to do two shows in one night was, was quite a lot of work. But I think it was just the, the thought of being at the Fillmore that sort of brought the energy level up. And I think we recorded it as well. And it was for the King Biscuit Flower Hour. Oh, I remember yeah. that, yeah. But for some reason, the recording got compromised somehow. We had to do it over again. We wound up doing it over a few months ago down in, in uh, San Diego. But... Um, yeah, I do remember that, and I think I've got some pictures too. Pretty, I was pretty crazy looking. I was going for the like, you know, eight day beer. Oh, you had the long hair in those days. The long days. hair, yeah, it was still frizzed out, and it was pretty crazy. <laughs> nice. You, uh, I know you've played all over the world. Um, what is your absolutely number one favorite venue? Is there one that you've played at? Small, large, whatever. Yeah. Wow. Uh, it it might be Royal Albert Hall, just for the unusual atmosphere there, because it's a it's People are very close, but um, at the same time, the thing is really tall, so it goes up, and I think there's four or five or six levels. Of balconies? It, yeah, balconies, and, and it's got an unusual presence to it, and then, of course, you just you keep thinking about it. You remember Cream and everybody playing there, and uh, it adds to the... The, the quality of the performance there. That's, the that's Royal amazing. Albert Hall in London, yes. we should mention. Yeah. Were there any uh, rock luminaries in the audience that night? I'm sure Brian May is always hanging out. Oh, Brian May. Are you a fan of his? Oh, are you kidding? Isn't that guy awesome? <laughs> he's amazing. Yeah. yeah. He's come on stage with us a lot. We play Shepherd's Bush. Uh, we did Wembley Arena in, I guess it was 95. And Excuse me. On. Wait a second. That that would be Dr. Brian May. The doctor. Because <laughs> he, he got his PhD, right? Yeah. In astronomy or a, some S- weird physics some, thing. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Radio astronomy. That is Amazing fabulous. guitar player, just amazing. Well, I still think the Fillmore is pretty damn cool. It is. And you guys are going to be there on Sunday, May 17th. Chicken Foot, what about this song, Soap on a Rope? Soap on a Rope. <laughs> What's up with that? What does it mean? I have no... you got to get Sammy in here to, to, to uh, yeah? you know, explain these songs. Uh, I can tell you, though, we were just sitting around, once again, just you know, having fun. And, and he was saying something that, you know, when you guys play, it sounds so good, I don't want to sing. And it was just, it came from the way that we would write songs. We'd just all be in a room about this size and we'd just play full on and, and we'd all be just making stuff up. And uh, so he was saying that and he thought, yeah, maybe we should do a song where you guys play and then stop and I sing, you know. So it was just from that little comment and I went home and I got inspired and, and wrote that piece of music. And then, but I wasn't ready for the whole soap on a rope thing. So <laughs> let's take a listen. Here it is Soap on a Rope, Chicken Foot from 1077, The Bone. 1077 The Bone. Streaming online at 1077thebone.com.